Hey, uh, this tutorial is all about uh, changing the color modes of a photograph. Okay, I have three photographs here. Let's take a look at the first one. First one is a grayscale. I'll just, I'll just tell you this is the original picture. And what we did, what I did is I make one a grayscale and one sepia. And another one, a colorize. I just put color, a uh, blue color for color effect. Now in Corel Draw, that's really easy to do. You're just playing with the color modes in a bitmap. So I just duplicated these three here so that we can do the effects, same effects as this one. The first effect is really easy. So you click on your colored photograph, and then you click on bitmap, and then you click on mode, and click on grayscale. Okay, that's it. So that's grayscale. Now the second one is actually a if you want a sepia look, so you click on the bitmap, or sorry, click on the photograph, you go to bitmap, and then you click on mode, and you go to do tone, convert to do tone. Now in do tone, when you click on that, that one, you're going to have a preview of what you're getting at. You know, This is the original image, and then here in the right side is the effect. So we want to go to monotone, so it's one tone, but instead of black here, double click on this color swatch here. And then you'll have some color swatches. So I'm going to look for that sepia tone. Uh, say I want uh, this sepia. And then click OK. And then before clicking OK here, you can preview it first. There. So that's kind of sepia look. Okay, preview again. And if I'm not really happy with the say I want it darker so I just double click on this again it will show up and I'll say I'll use that one and then click on preview again here and then click OK looks good now the other one is the blue effect so it's the same thing as the sepia look but just changing the color to blue so you go to bitmap again and then click on mood click on do tone and then double click on this black swatch here and then uh, let's go to the dark blue here and then click OK. And then you can preview it first. And then you can move this hand here so that you could see how it looks like. But you have to click on preview again. And then if I'm happy with that one, just click on OK. So that's it. Very, very easy technique. And you can even play around with the uh, with the with the colors. You know, make it. You know, like wild colors and stuff like that.